And then she began singing. On Thursday, December 17th, Sandra Cisneros, the author of a book called The House on Mango Street, came to Seward for a visit. Seward was the only school in Chicago she visited. Last year, five Seward 8th grade girls were in a group that read Ms. Cisneros' book. They sent her a letter asking her to come to Seward. What interested you in this book? The characters. Well, I could relate to them, like they were friends or something, because their lives were related to my friends' um, lives. My favorite story was not speaking English because, you know, it related to Mexico and, and to America, you know, and how people, you know, how, how sad they felt, you know, not, not being in their home country. I think I started writing probably, you know, because I was very lonely. You know, I grew up uh, with eight other people in the house, but uh, my mother was real busy trying to raise us, and my six brothers kept to themselves when we were public. They used to play with me in the house, but when we went outside, um, they didn't play with me. These five girls participated in an assembly with Mrs. Nettles by reading some of her stories. She read and also talked about her own childhood in Chicago. When I was growing up, the Chicago Public Library had the card catalog. And my dream was to see my name in the card catalog, but not just in the card catalog, but in a card that was all dirty. Because the ones that were dirty, you could tell those were the books that people loved, that people took out of the library. And I thought, oh, wouldn't it be wonderful to have a card that says Cisneros, comma, Sandra. Teachers and students were impressed with her work. After she read, students were able to ask questions. Her being an author and, and having such a good book and being famous was really special of having her here with us and talking to us because I've never talked to an author and with such a good book, like the one I read. The two languages are what make my story special. My being Mexican is what makes my writing so very, very special. I'm very proud about that, about my culture. Reporting for SSN, this is Paula Gonzalez.